everyone welcome back to my channel i'm so glad you guys are here it is tasty tuesday and today i'm going to be doing another dessert i'm going to be doing a lemonade ice box pie so i'm going to focus the camera down and we're going to make this pie together all right so for the ingredients we need an eight ounce thing of cream cheese softened one 14 ounce can of sweetened condensed milk we're going to be using three quarters cup of the lemonade concentrate that's been thawed and Lisey's sneezing. And then <clears throat> one eight ounce container of Cool Whip Thawed, and then our nine inch graham cracker crust pie crust. So let me get my ingredients measured out with the, the lemonade, and then I'll be right back. All right, so what we're going to do is beat the cream cheese and the condensed milk until it's smooth, and then I'm gonna add in the lemonade. So I have the cream cheese open, and I'm gonna take my bowl off here for a second. Dump my cream cheese in the bowl. <clears throat> All right, now I'm gonna add in the milk and I'm gonna grab my spatula because I wanna get everything out of there. So I'm just gonna dump in the sweetened condensed milk. And just scrape everything out of the can. All right, so we got that in there. I'm gonna put my mixer down, lock it in place, plug it in. And now I'm just gonna beat this until it's smooth. So that's nice and smooth. Now we're going to add in the lemonade concentrate. So three quarters cup of that. And now we're just going to mix that in together. yellow food coloring just to give it that lemony color which I think I'm going to do so I'm just going to open up my <clears throat> food coloring here <clears throat> and <clears throat> excuse me just going to add in a couple drops Let's start with two So I put three drops of yellow food coloring in there. Now we're going to fold in the Cool Whip. So I'm gonna unplug and remove everything from here. <clears throat> All right, so we have the batter mixed up there. We're gonna add in the Cool Whip and we're just gonna fold this in. So you don't wanna stir it or whip it. You're just gonna gently fold and drop the Cool Whip container. So just kind of bring the batter up and over and just incorporate the Cool Whip in with the cream cheese and the milk.
pour this in our pie crust and then you're just going to put it in the refrigerator and let it set up and I'm bringing this up to church so I'm filling this on Sunday and this is going to be for our ladies women's meeting so I'm hoping within the next oh three hours it will set up nicely into the pie crust. I'm not putting the plastic lid back on A because it's got a crack in it and B I don't think it will fit down on top of this. So I won't be able to do a taste test and let you know how it tastes, but I'm going to just have a little bit here on my spatula and have a little pre-test because I know it's going to taste good. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> so before I bring it up to church, I'll pull it back out of the fridge so you can see what it looks like right now. It's got that little soupy look to it, but it should set up nicely within the next three hours. So I'm just going to place this in the refrigerator and then I'll be back to show you what it looks like. And then maybe I'll just insert a little picture after I get it cut up and onto a plate at church tonight to let you know what it looks like when I cut it into it. So I'll be back a little bit later. All right, so there it is out of the refrigerator. I'm getting ready to head up to church. Once I get there, I'll just slice up one, put it on a plate, take a picture in there. But I will have a link down below for the recipe. You guys can check that all out. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And like I said, the little tasting that I did um, before I put it in the refrigerator tasted really, really good. I hope you guys give it a try. And until next time, remember to live a little, laugh a lot, and love always. Bye, guys.